The FIA have introduced a series of updates for this weekend's Azerbaijan Grand Prix. FIA bosses have introduced a third major rule change for this weekend's Azerbaijan Grand Prix just one day before on-track action begins. The latest alteration is a reduction to the DRS zone which will be 100 meters shorter in 2023 than last season. In 2022, the second DRS zone was positioned 347 meters after turn 20 but the race director notes show this will now sit 447 meters after the corner. It means drivers will have less time to make a move stick on the run up to the tight turn 1. However, the length of the first DRS zone on the exit of turn 2 will remain the same as last year. The detection point on the exit of turn 20 will also stay the same as in previous seasons. DRS zones have been altered at several venues for 2023 in a bid to make the tool less effective. The final activation point was moved in Jeddah while a fourth zone was added in Melbourne for the Australian Grand Prix. New updates are expected to come into place for next weekend's Miami Grand Prix. The tweaks come just months after former F1 director Ross Braun warned F1 should not be afraid to reduce the effect of DRS at some circuits. He told Motorsport.com, The one thing we know is fans, and we know this because we don't like it. They don't like the, go down the straight, pop the DRS, overtake, drive fast, pull a gap, all of that. I think in an ideal world DRS is used just to get on the back of someone, so you can really have a decent attack. The latest rule comes just days after bosses introduced a further two updates for the Azerbaijan Grand Prix weekend. The first of which will involve a major format update with revisions to how sprint races are run over the rest of 2023. Friday's qualifying will set the grid for Sunday's race with a separate three-part knockout session to determine the order for the shorter race on Saturday. The sprint will also lose much of its jeopardy with grid positions no longer up for grabs. Max Verstappen has pushed against holding more sprint events with Red Bull boss Christian Horner suggested holding a sprint in Baku was ludicrous. F1 team bosses have also agreed to an increase on the number of components teams are allowed. Drivers will now be able to fit four internal combustion engines, ICE, turbochargers, TC, MGUH and MGK devices over the course of the season, up from three. It could be a major boost to George Russell who is expected to take a new unit in Baku after his previous engine exploded into flames in Australia.